Hey, what's up, everyone? What's up, Jared? So today is Saturday, December 29th, and it is like 8 o'clock in the morning, and I'm about to head over to a restaurant called Savoy's and have breakfast. I've got a story about how they got their name later, but for now, it is like 32 degrees outside. When, so when I first got here, I've been home for a little less than a week, probably like four days, and when I first got here, it was like 50s, 40s maybe, so not super bad but not great. But now, this week, it's gonna get really bad. It's gonna be super fucking cold all the time, so I'm not looking forward to that. But, right now, I'm heading off to Savoy's. All right, so we just got back from Savoy's, uh, and on the way back, we actually stopped by the glass blowing studio and picked up my bowl, my implosion bowl, and I'll talk about that later. But uh, first, I wanna just tell a story, a little story that I think is pretty cool about uh, the Savoy restaurant and how they got their name. So Savoy's has been around forever, like a hundred years. Like that's not hyperbole, that's like an actual number. They've been around for like literally a hundred years. But uh, before they got their names, they weren't originally called Savoy's, they were called something else. And uh, they actually went to like a sign making place to get their sign made for the restaurant. And what happened is they went to, to order their sign and when they got in there, the guy was like, hold on a second, wait a minute. Before you guys order your sign, uh, we have this sign back in the back that someone just ordered and left here and never picked up. So what we'll do is if you just get that sign, we'll give you a big discount and it'll be basically free. And they were like, all right, well, what's the sign say on it? And it, was, it says Savoy's. So they were like, well, I guess, I guess that's gonna be the name of our restaurant then. And so they just bought the sign and that's how they became the Savoy restaurant. So I, I think that's pretty cool. It's kind of a unique story. But uh, anyways, so I just picked up my, my glass bowl that I made, uh, and here it is. It's called an implosion bowl. You can see it's got uh, green and blue kind of swirls on it. Uh, and it's called an implosion bowl because the way they make it is different than how they make other bowls. Basically what happens is they, they blow a ball of glass, uh, and then they let the ball cool, and they only heat like one side of it. And what they'll do is they suck the air out of the, out of the ball, and, and it, the ball implodes on itself. So basically this is actually a hollow bowl and there's actually air in, in the middle of this. Uh, and I, I'd never uh, heard of that before, but uh, here it is, an implosion bowl. Hopefully I'll be making more stuff like this in the future. What's up everyone, so today is December 30th. I'm about to head over to my Oma's house because my cousin Trevor is there right now. Uh, Trevor lives in Kansas, so even when I do get to come home, usually I don't get to see him. So uh, it should be pretty fun. But something random that I'm going to share with you guys right now. So on Christmas, I got uh, several gifts. Uh, and one of those gifts from my parents was uh, an advent calendar. And uh, I unwrapped it and I was like, you guys know that this is not how this is supposed to work, right? And they were like, yeah, whatever. And I was like, okay, cool. So for the past like five days, I've just been stuffing my face with chocolate. What's up everyone? So I'm here at uh, my Oma's house with uh, my aunt, Lisa, and my cousin Trevor, who I haven't seen in a while. Right now they're trying to uh, set up the Alexa dot that, uh, that Oma got for Christmas. So this is my cousin Trevor. Okay. Trevor, say hi. What's up? I know. I'm gonna hi. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So when uh, when Trevor came over here, he uh, brought some hot wings and some ribs. And about five minutes after they came out of the oven, they were gone. They didn't even make it to the table. So uh, I just finished uh, at my Oma's house and now I am on my way to my cousin, my other cousin Cameron's house and he's got a new VR system and we're going to test it out. We'll see how that works. I've never done VR before so we'll see. All right, so unfortunately Cameron got kind of busy with doing stuff so I wasn't able to hang out with him for as long as I wanted to. But I will be hanging out with him for sure before I leave. 
Uh, also, I will definitely be making a vlog for uh, New Year's and New Year's Eve. So you can be looking out for that in the next three, two, two three days. Uh, but until then, I'll see you later. <laughs>